today we're going to spend some time working up to a five rep max. We're going to adequately warm up and then we'll go ahead and take three sets to work to that five rep max. There may be an instance where you thought your third set would be your five rep max and it's not and you wanted to go more. Go ahead, treat one of those first two sets as a warm up and continue on. We're just getting to your heaviest five that you can accomplish for the day. Now, we wanna focus on a few things. If you're tight, maybe in the beginning when it's still light in your warm up, spend some time at the bottom of the squat doing some tempo squats or some pause squats. Getting that bar nice and high up and resting on your shoulder is gonna be that first foundation to a good squat. If your wrists are something that is, feels a little torqued and overworked, release a few fingers and let that fingertip grip really be uh, the charging force. There might be slight pressure on your neck and that's all right. All right, you should still be able to breathe, however. When we go into that squat, again, if you're super tight, sit down at the bottom and just take a second to kind of camp out feel those end ranges release and relax and then we can stand up out of it again when we do the five rep max in this workout that's going to be five continuous reps without putting it back on the rack if the event that you get stuck on a rep and you have to fail you're going to go ahead and at the bottom you're going to put the bar to the ground and you're going to move your body away your safety is the number one thing, so we want to make sure that you know how to properly bail out of the bar in the event that you get stuck. The front squat's not typically a time for somebody to spot you. That's one that you can dump on the ground pretty easily. However, if you would like somebody to help you with a forced rep, a forced rep happens when somebody helps you out of the bottom of one of those reps. The easiest way is if you have two other buddies and when you're squatting, they're gonna just provide a little bit of assistance on the sides of the bar. That's only in the event when you have three people with you or two others, you being the third, being able to help you with a forced rep. Otherwise, if there's not a lot of you there, just dump it on the ground. You can strip it off and reattempt if you have time. Again, we're going for the five rep max, and this will be something directly related to the workout.